Mr. Chair, uh, thank you. Distinguished uh, colleagues and all our guests uh, from uh, various government agencies, uh, a short manifestation of po. Ganang araw po sa inyong uh, lahat. I would like to express my uh, full support to the proposed uh, budgets of the three agencies that are here with us today. The Presidential Legislative Liaison, Liaison uh, Office, the Games and Amusement Board, and the Philippine Sports Commission. Una-una, supportado ko po ang PNLO dahil uh, sa kanilang contribution sa pag-coordinate at pag-unify ng uh, Ekotibo at Kongreso sa pagpasa uh, ng uh, iba't ibang importanteng batas na nais sa uh, isulong ng uh, administrasyon ni Pangulong Duterte. The PLLO is uh, vital in promoting the presidential legislative uh, initiatives, policy reforms, and uh, development programs by tirelessly working with Congress in making these uh, matters a reality. Pangalawa, supportado ko rin po ang uh, pagbigay ng uh, kaukulang budget sa PSC at uh, GAB as the chairman of the Senate Committee on Sports and as as a passionate advocate for sports development in the country, I believe that uh, investing in, in sports uh, will not only allow our country to develop more world-class athletes uh, who can bring pride, honor, and medals to our country, but will also help us in keeping our uh, youth away from illegal drugs and other harmful vices. Sa katunayan, ito po ang aking hangad nung isinulong ko ang Republic Act number 11470 upang buksan ang National Academy for Sports at New Clark City para sa mga kabataang atleta at meron na mga nag-enroll ngayong uh, school year uh, na ito. Uh, sa tulong na rin po ni uh, Senator Pia Cayetano na uh, mapabilis at mabuksan rin po kagad ngayong taong ito, itong National Academy for Sports. Mr. Chair, let me point out that the uh, uh, that the PSC and GAB needs uh, budgetary support fr from us now more than ever as they are uh, finding uh, it difficult to keep our uh, sports program afloat during the COVID-19 uh, uh, pandemic. During the deliberation of last year's budget, I uh, advocated uh, for the inclusion of 100 million, which was later on increased to 250 million. This was necessary to uh, uh, support our athletes' uh, preparations for the Olympics and other international events. Uh, similarly, I also supported the allocation of an additional uh, uh, 7.945 million budget for Paralympics uh, preparations. Nagpapasalaman po tayo sa mga kasama natin sa support para sa mga ito. Uh, aside from the, aside the, the budget deliberation, outside the budget deliberations, I also sought assistance uh, from the private sectors to help uh, finance the training of our promising athletes. Bukod po dito, Tumulong din po ako sa pag sa ating gobyerno na may sama po ang ating mga Olympians sa COVID-19 na vaccine priority list ng panahong uh, uh, konti pa lang po ang ating bakuna upang maging ligtas sila sa pag ensayo at uh, pakipag-lohok uh, sa Tokyo Olympics. Mr. Chair, nagbunga naman po ang maganda nating uh, pagbibigay ng sapat na budget sa ating mga atleta. For the first time ever, nagkaroon po tayo ng kauna-unahang uh, gold medal kasama po ang dalawang silver medals at isang bronze medal. Uh, nap napakalaking uh, karangalan po ito para sa ating uh, bansa. Through our efforts, the Philippines became the top performing country in Southeast Asia in the recent uh, Tokyo Olympics. Kaya naman po, inihing mo ko ang ating mga kasamahan na suportahan ng budget ng PSC at GAP. Uh, para tuloy-tuloy lang po ang uh, sports development sa ating bansa. For these uh, reasons, I have no objections uh, to the proposed budget at kung pwede pa pong dagdagan ay dagdagan pa po natin. Ako po ay natutuwa dahil nagagamit ng gusto ang uh, pondong pinagkaloob sa ating mga ahensya noong nakarang taon. Despite the limited budgetary resources, this year I am sure that our agencies will likewise utilize the budget uh, prudently and wisely for the benefit of our nation. Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. Chair.